Right, welcome Joey Abel to England uh, for your fight with Tyson Fury this Saturday night at the Copper Box Arena. How are things going? Excellent. It couldn't be going better. I, had, uh, I took this fight on short notice, but I've been working ever since the last fight uh, in December. So, feeling real good. And Tyson Fury, um, he's your opponent. What have you seen of him? Um, he, he's, got, he's got his uh, qualities. You know, he's, he's tall, he's got long arms. He's tough. He's got uh, things going for him that a lot of people don't. Uh, I don't. I think he has a lot of chinks in his armor, though, and I think I can expose him. And talking about your chinks in the armor, what you've seen of Tyson, what do you bring to the table, and what do you see your strength is, strength are in the fight? Um, I, I think I got um, I got strength. I got uh, speed and agility, and I think um, athletic wise, I, I think I'm more athletic than he is. He's got you know. A couple, like I said, he's got he's got a couple things on me as well, but I um, I think I got the um, power to to do what I need to do to win. And you've been in with some of the top guys in the division, like Chris Ariola, Fraser Quendo, and in your last fight, you gave Kabrat Pulev some some prob early problems um, against Tyson. Do you see the how do you view him as uh, a challenge? I, I think he's going to be a he's gonna, it's going to be a good fight. You know, if if he does what he's supposed to do and I do what I'm supposed to do, it's going to be a it's going to be a war as long as it lasts. But uh, you know, all the top guys that I fought against, they all brought different qualities to the table. And I, I think he has um, a different kind of quality, but um, he, he's bringing the same things. You know, he's bringing, he, he, like I said, his size is his main, his main uh, thing that he's got going for him. So. And you're a huge puncher yourself. You had 28 KOs out of your 29 wins. Uh, we've seen Tyson Floyd in his last fight against Steve Cunningham and then uh, various other fights, uh, but he's got up to win. Um, do you think you could put him down and actually keep him down? I def if, if he goes down, he's going to stay down. You know, I'm not. I, I don't. Uh, what Cunningham hit him with was a nice punch, but you know, if I hit him with that same punch, he'd be probably still in there. And a win against Fury, what will do that do for your career? Um, if you beat him over here, what, what, what opportunities do you think will be coming your way? You know, and that's that's another thing that I, th I think people think that I'm here for the money. You know, I'm not here for the money. I'm here for the opportunity. Um, when I win, it's going to be a it's going to be a huge step. I'm sure they're going to offer me a re rematch, and I'll give it to them because I don't want anybody thinking it was a fluke. Um, it's it's, it's going to it's a, an opportunity that not a lot of people uh, that, like me get because you know, in order to fight a top guy like this, you, you can't just you, you know it just doesn't happen every day. And I got I got the call. Um, so I'm going to use it to my advantage. I'm going to win, and I'm going to um, go from there. Lastly, um, it's like a double US hit team with you and uh, Kevin Johnson over here. Kevin Scott, uh, Derek Chisora. Um, do you see you see it both being a double a double victory, like a Brit bashing between you you and uh, Kevin coming away the victory? You know, I was talking I was talking to Kevin a little bit, and I, I know he's not here to lose. You know, he's he's here for the same kind of opportunity. He's a little bit. Uh, He's farther along in his career than I am, and he's done a lot more things than I have. But I definitely think a double victory is very possible. Finally, uh, the fight's live and exclusive in the UK on Box Nation. Uh, what can you tell the UK fans uh, to expect? Uh, a war, you know. I, w whether you're against uh, Fury or um, or for him, either way, you know, you, you want to see a fight. And I definitely think that there's going to be a good fight going on. Thank you, Joey. Thank you.